What's up guys, GT Gamer here and welcome back to Transport Fever Los Santos. And I've been quite busy, I've put in all the lines, all the signals, all the routes. The only thing I haven't really done is put in the vehicles. And we just got a ton of new vehicles actually, all of them box cars. I think it's just different designs of the same box car. And it is time to put vehicles on the new lines. Now, I'm not going to do what I used to do, which is just to spend all my money putting vehicles on lines and hope it works. Because on a si system this big, on a scale this big, if that doesn't work, you are financially ruined. Like, there's no two ways about it. You are done. So we've got to put be careful while we do. We've got to put things on slowly. And then when they start to work, the routes, and we've ironed out all the bugs because it's guaranteed that it's not going to work perfectly first time then we're going to start ripping up the old lines and getting rid of them so here's one of the depots i put in i put in this big one parallel to these two tracks because i thought it looked pretty cool i think that looks pretty awesome and the way i solve the problem of getting across so many lines is i put a straight line across with a depot on each end and just a load of double slip switches so we can put trains on in either direction. I think that's a pretty elegant solution, I've got to be fair. And it doesn't look half bad either. The only problem is the catenary kind of breaks. It breaks the catenaries. So what do we want to put on? Well, first things first, we need to get things into the hub. So we have a line and I cannot remember what it's called. The TF Conmap Polito. No, that's not it. It's the TF Food Hub. That is going to start taking food down into the hub. Right, I'm going to pause it because otherwise it just won't work. <laughs> it's as simple as that. So by trains, I'm just going to put one on for now, I think. No, I'm going to put two on. Uh, what should we use? So these are all the new box cars we got. It's all the same thing, just with different libraries which is cool we can make a multi-library train i think that's cool we can also do that with the tank wagons because we have a few different designs for those it's definitely pretty cool right what do we want um it's 1932 it is tempting to start moving into diesel and electric trains the only diesel train we got is this the alco hh 600 which not really very useful it's underpowered, very heavy, and has a top speed of 50, so I don't think. Maybe on a mountain route that'd be okay, but not for our purposes. What about the Milwaukee? 70 miles an hour. Very powerful, and a lot of traffic, tra tractive effort. I think that's what we'll use, so buy that. And uh, which is my favourite? Chicago, Great Northern, New York Central. The Reading one's quite nice. I'm thinking it's being plain though. Southern Pacific. Yeah, go on. One, two, three, four, five. I just noticed how expensive these are. Jeez. Six, seven, eight. We're going to go for eight of those. And I'm going to have two trains. This is going to go on TF Food Hub. <coughs> Hub. All the train lines that go to the hub, I've put hub on the end so I can distinguish them. It's quite a good system, I think. So you're going to go on there. Right, and then we need something to distribute the food. So, uh, we want one train on the Polito line. I'm thinking something different for this. What about this? Mm, I don't know. Mikado's. Uh, the best we got really is the Milwaukee Bipolars, they're called. This, the locomotive, commonly known as Bipolars, were one of the most interesting and complex designs ever developed and made up of less than no, th with n made up of no less than three articulated sections. Yeah, go on in, I suppose. And boxcar wise, we will use. Uh, what shall we use? I'm thinking 
Union Pacific this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They are so expensive. Jesus Christ, man. This is going on TF Food Polito Hub. And then we want to distribute it to the city as well. Oh. Uh, that's this depot here. Buy trains. And we want Milwaukee's. Buy. And we want... What should we use for this? I'm thinking one of the blue ones. Maybe Great Northern. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Down to 70. We spent 50 million already. Jeez. Right, this is TF. Food LS Hub. So chuck that on there. Right, now we want to do. Oh no, actually, we got to put a train on this side as well. This is going out to here. And this is going to get split and distributed between North Chumash and. Come on, auto save. And South Chumash by here. I put in this lovely little road bridge across here. Which I say little is actually really big. Right. Uh, did I put a depot in for here? Yes, I did. I put in this one here. And I'm thinking the same one for this. Or should we use... Yeah, let's use a Mikado for this, actually. Mikado. And I'm also going to opt for the old boxcar. Because it's cheaper. And does it carry more? Or less, even? Yeah, it does. But... This is, like, not one of our main lines, I don't think. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Set you on TF Food Chumash Hub. Right, that's all the trains for now. I'm only going to do food for now. And when this kicks up, that's when I'm going to start doing uh, fuel. Well, fuel's going to be last because I haven't put in the infrastructure for it. So after food, I'm going to start doing construction materials. So what do we want now? We want trucks. Where's a truck depot? There's one up here. So I'll put these ones in first. So road vehicles. We got the Mac AC. We did get the Ford Model 77. And is it better? Yeah, it carries more and it's faster, but it's a lot more expensive. So... I don't really know if there's much point having that, because it only carries one more. And it's not a massive difference in speed either, like 6 miles an hour. I think stick to max, which are only 50,000. So we want 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, just to get the line going. These are going to be on RF... Uh, what is this line called? Polito... Let me go over here so we all illuminate the line when it's the right one. It'd be Polito... Food, no, it's not that one. Polito Food 1, that's the one. So chuck them on there. Right, that's that done. Now we want to go across to Chumash, and we have a depot right here, that's useful. Buy road vehicles, Mac AC. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Set on Chumash Food 1. And one, two, three, four, five. Set you on North Chumash Food One. Right, and now we oh, close. Now we gotta do the city. And I put in three lines for the city for food, three lines for construction materials, and I haven't done any for fuel yet. I don't know why I didn't do fuel, I just didn't think it was necessary for the time being. So the three lines, we got one going to Vinewood, one going to Del Perro, and one going to Los Santos. I haven't done lines for Elysian Island, Cypress Flats, or La Mesa yet. That's quite important to note. I'm probably going to put in its own little separate hub. I'll probably do that when I put the fuel in or before I put the fuel in. I haven't decided yet. That's why I didn't put in. I just wasn't sure how I wanted it, where would be a good place for it. Right, so where's the depot in the city? There's one over here somewhere. Where is it? There. Buy road vehicles. Mac AC. One, two, three, four, five. I just want to run through this, make sure it's all working. So, we've already got a line to take 
cows up to the food farm. That's the one by there which we put in with these two lovely bridges. And then the food will get processed. And this actually uses a different system, different station. That's going to be taken along there to the hub. And then it's going to be shipped out to there, there and there. I think that's all good. There's one important thing to note, I have changed the system a little bit because you might notice I've taken out the bridge which goes to this stone mine and the reason for that is I work in logistics and I tried to base this off a real logistics thing and I realised that the old system where I was going to get an object, say stone, take it from the quarry, take it to the hub, then from the hub take it to the construction materials plant down here then from the plant take it back to the hub to be distributed and I just realized that that was a stupid idea because it's twice as many trips as necessary the trains would only be running half full like full for half the journey and I just thought it'd be more appropriate that instead of doing that we just got a train to take it straight from the quarry down to the uh, construction materials plant as we've been doing or the food plant either one and then from the food plant bringing it up to the hub which is where this tunnel going under here comes in play of course we haven't set that up yet because we are not using um, we're not distributing construction materials yet that's the words I was looking for right I think we're all done now so I want to ride the train uh, there should be some trains in the depot if I press play, first train that comes out is this one. Right, so I just want to ride it just for a little bit, just to see all this track with all this catenary through the mains. I think that's going to be cool. So let's play. Bear in mind, I haven't smoothed all of it yet. I've only smoothed a little bit here and there. There's still a lot of work to be done on this system, but mark my words, it will get done. Just very slowly so we don't waste all our money. So it goes across all these tracks on a very bumpy ride and by there turns left and go through this valley which started out so thin you could barely get a motorway through it and now is very very wide and it's got like how many tracks it got 10 i think i know it's hard to count from this angle oh there's another train on the left over there yeah this is part that needs smoothing by here we're racing that train over there on the left that's cool I reckon we'll beat it. I'm almost certain we're going to beat it. I'll be very surprised if we don't actually. Yeah, this needs smoothing here particularly. Again, very busy now the map is, isn't it? Bit of a game freeze for there. Probably the end of the month. And then this is where the line splits off. There's the tunnel down there. And it goes into the old station, which is going to get changed and moved around eventually. And then it joins under here and into the station where it picks up food. That's perfect. Look at those new carriages, by the way. That's awesome. Let me just hook onto this train briefly. Look at that. I think that looks really cool with those carriages like that. So it splits off here and goes down and joins the rest of the tracks. So these lines here, they're not going to exist much longer. Let's just put it like that. Right. Now we need to go round and look for bugs and errors and things I've missed. They should become fairly apparent. I'm just wondering whether I should start putting the construction materials in. We've got 65 million, there or thereabouts. Well, more than that now. Um, yeah, I think we should. I'm just concerned we won't have enough. Um, is it worth it? Yeah, I think it is. Right, so, what do I want to do? I want to... First things first, I want to get the construction materials to the hub. Now, we've got a line taking the stone down, so, from, it'd be this depot here, I want to buy train. Ooh, is this electrified? It is electrified, so we can use these. So, Milwaukee's and um, what car should we use? I like that one, it's got my initials on it 
by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Duplicate. Set you all on TF Conmac Herb, I believe that is. Yep. Right. And by trains, we want... I'm thinking use Atlantics for this. By train. And I'm going to use the old carriages as well, just until it settles in, then we can always upgrade them later. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's a good job I decided on that, because look how... F we're almost out of money, how's that possible? Set you all... <coughs> set you all on... After this autosave. TF LS... Conmat LS Hub. There you go. That's coming out now. And now over here, I want buy trains, Atlantic, buy, and boxcar, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Set you all, at, yep, set line all, TF, Chumash, uh, no, it would be Conmat, Chumash, I can't see it. Am I going blind? Yep. Is that it? Yep, that's the one. And finally, over at this massive depot here, by train, Atlantic, by, and I want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Yep, that's eight. Set you all on Conmat Polito Hub. Perfect. That is peachy. So this hub should start getting busy now. There's probably not going to be anything here for a while. Simply because it takes a while for the game to pick up the line. Start sending stuff there. But when that starts happening we should make an absolute killing. I just want to check the profits. See what's losing us the most money right now. Uh, yeah I want that one. No, I don't. I want it the other way round. So, making us the most are the two Halo lines and TF Conmat main one. Uh, wow. I'm surprised. I didn't think that I'd make that much money so soon. The Stab City line. Right, what's losing? These are all the lines we haven't set up yet. Oh, I need to set those up. Thank God I noticed that. Wow. That could have been bad. Right, vehicles, by road vehicles, Mac, one, two, three, four, five. Set you on Chumash, RF Chumash, Con Mac one. Right, I've put all the vehicles on and I'm just sorting out a problem I had. The trucks can't drop off at this station here, so I've got to put in a bus stop, like so. And after Vinewood Transfer, you are going to drop off there so you reach all the areas. That is perfect. That's exactly how I wanted it. Right, back to the profits. What's losing us the most money? TF Comac Leo. Basically, all the lines we just put in. RF Central Food. What are you? Right. To be honest, we won't need that line much longer, so it's pointless taking it out. How much is it losing us? Uh, only 160,000, 170,000. I don't know, perhaps we'd be better off just getting rid of that line. Honestly. Yeah, because food's getting distributed down there anyway, so if anything, that's eating at our profits. So, our essential food, you, go to the depot and be sold, and get rid of the line. There you go. Right, now what's losing us the most money? RF Design Kudo Farm, not really surprised by that. In fact, we can get rid of the boat lines now. There are a lot of lines we don't need anymore. Which is a shame, because I spent all that line putting the, the ships in. I think we should keep them a little bit longer, but not put any more vehicles on any of the lines. Basically, stop maintaining the old systems and start implementing new things on the new systems, like the hub system. And then, over time, start phasing out lines that we no longer need. 
I think that would probably be the best system. In fact, I'm almost certain of that. How much have we got? 9.9 .9 million. How much loan do we... S yeah, I'm going to repay as much of the loan as I can. I think that would be a smart idea. We're probably going to go negative for a little bit. Oh, just jumped up again. Go, we're making money so fast now. Could probably pay off this loan in five minutes. Right, we're down to 18.5 million loans, so our interest should be less at the end of the year. I'm just keeping an eye on these lines because... Honestly, if something's broken, the sooner I spot it, the better. Ooh, we got food at the hub. We have got food at the hub. And where is it going? 33 for Chumash. That's surprising. A fair bit for Los Santos and a little bit for Polito. God, this is actually working well for the food part. The construction materials, how are you doing? Uh... Are there any trains? I just want to make sure the line's not broken. So it's Conmat Hub, that one. Is that it? Yep, that's it. So vehicles, where are you? You are near Elysian Island. You're down in the south of the city. And you are on your way there. Let's ride you. I, this is so awesome with the like loads of lines with a highway in the middle. I really like that. Let's go first person through the city. Actually, probably a dumb idea. Should probably close this first. Should we go first person or third? I'm thinking third actually, so I can keep an eye on how much they pick up. So if I pop them up there, look at that. We're going 71 miles per hour. Oh, this is cool. Look at that, coming over the brow of the hill, seeing all the houses. Oh, I love this game so much. If only my frame rate was better. <laughs> Once the performance gets fixed on this game, it's going to be the most amazing game ever. So we're coming through the city now. Look how busy this got. I built this area, like rebuilt this area with this bridge. Literally last episode or the one before last. And already it's full. Right, is that train picked up yet? No. Has it? Oh, it didn't pick anything up. Will this one pick anything up? I hope so. I really do hope so. Why did that one not pick anything up? Perhaps it just hasn't picked up the line yet. I do hope nothing's broken. This one should pick up now. It has to. Um. Uh, I'm going to pay some of the loan off. Down to 15. Let's go 14. Come on, pick something up. Please, pick something up. No, no, no. I've lost my cursor. Turn around. You will pick something up. Come on. Nothing. Nothing at all. No path electric. What? Okay, that's weird. And turn around. Come on, man. I want some. I want you to pick something up. I could tell it to wait until it has something, but that would just hold up the other line massively. And the other line's making us a lot of money. Damn, that's annoying. There's loads of stuff there, just none of it for this line. It's got to pick it up soon. It has to. Oh my god, we're actually negative for the first time in forever. Uh, I'm going to keep an eye on that. That needs to start picking stuff up soon. Look how much food we got here already. Jeez, what? I know that's spread across a lot of lines, but still. 158 for LS Hub. I think we need another train on that. Ooh, I don't know. Let's keep an eye on that. Let us keep an eye on that. Oh, we've got construction materials for LS Hub. Where the heck did they come from? That doesn't make any sense. The train hasn't picked any of it up. Where has that come from? Huh. 
No, that's food. It's put food on my line. God, I'm blind. Yeah, we don't want that. Uh, what can I do to stop it? Uh... Right, okay. I know what I can do. <coughs> my voice is so bad today. Um. Right, what I'm going to do... It's a bit unprecedented, but I pretty much have to. I'm going to separate the lines. I'm going to have to go around and replace the vehicles on it. But I'm going to separate the lines into what they're supposed to carry. So, like, for example, Chumash Con Mat. Go on replacement. Get the vehicle and set that to only carry construction materials. Okay. Replace now. Although... That won't work, will it? No, because the trains will still carry it. Um, how can we separate these lines out? That's a good point. Hang on a minute. Is it boxcars that actually carry construction materials? Uh, please don't. Uh, I think I've may have just made a massive stupid mistake. Yeah. Ah, you... Damn it. That's why. God, I bet some of you noticed that. Right, I've got the wrong cars. I need to go around and change a lot of lines. Fortunately, they all go to the same place, so I can just go through and do that. So, vehicles, replacement, replace now. In fact, what's on there? Eight cars. So, one of these, add, and eight state cars because I'm a blooming idiot one two three four five six seven eight uh, replace now nine million I don't have nine million ah. is that yeah that's the line that brings them to the platform so I gotta replace them first so back out comes my loan jeez that was a massive mess up on my um, I'm actually angry at myself for that that was such a stupid thing to do. Right, replace you. All I need to do is replace one of these lines, then we'll have a demand. So what's on here? That is an Atlantic add. And eight of these, eight state cars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you replace, oh, come on, replace now. Yeah. Oh, that was extremely cheap to change. God, if the others are that cheap, then phew, should be able to do this easy. Uh, yep, yeah, Atlantic with eight cars. So, Atlantic, yep. Yeah. It's because the other cars were so expensive that we might actually get money back from some of them. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I don't think I clicked one of them then. One, two, three, four, five, yep. Yeah. Six, seven, eight. Close you. Replace now. 120,000. We can afford that. And you. Vehicles. Check what it is. Atlantic. Yep. So Atlantic. Add. And we want state cars once again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Close. And replace now, 145,000. Right, hopefully this should start working now. God, that was a stupid mistake. And we can actually afford to repay most of our loan. Keep clicking. <coughs> my voice is really sore today, my throat is. Been shouting a lot this week. <laughs> right, now our loan's only one, one million. We should be able to pay that back in literally a minute. Right, now will we get construction materials? That is the million dollar question. So let's jump down here. I can't believe I made that mistake. And are you going to put any on the line? Does it tell us the demand for each specific line? No. Look at that though, the potential is 9,816. Wow. It's only at 800 though, so, hmm. right, anything, 
this needs to work. It'll probably pick it up at the end of the month or something. I am going to keep an eye on that. I'm going to put it in the corner to keep an eye on it. This hub system's working quite well though, other than the fact we got food on that line which it can't use. Hmm. Yep, it's changed over now. So hopefully it'll figure that out and get rid of that food on that line. Or transfer it to another line, hopefully. I don't know why it did that. Well, I do, because there was boxcars, but still. It should have noticed by now that it's it can't use it, that line can't, so it'll put it somewhere else. I really want this system to work, though. And the good news is we've paid off all our loan now, so... The end of the year won't be quite so devastating. Not like it is now anyway, we earn so much. We've got 150 waiting to go to Los Santos. So I'm thinking we need another train on there. Yeah, I'm going to put another train on there. So, by train. Milwaukee. Oh, we have not got enough money for that. Wow. Okay, suppose we have to wait a bit. How much are they? Quite expensive, if I remember right. Yeah, eight and a half million. We should get that pretty soon. I could take out a loan, but honestly, I don't want to. I just simply do not want to. It's not urgent. Food can build up there indefinitely, pretty much. Why is one? I'm guessing the demand for one for the LS line is just so much higher. It gotta be that. Right. What I do need to do is go around to all the truck lines. And make sure that there's not a massive build up there. 18, yeah, I can deal with that. Bloody hell, look at all the food up here, Jesus. All of that is for that line. God, we need more vehicles on there. As soon as we get enough money, I'm putting more vehicles on there. Uh, why is there food waiting there? Not quite understand that. Don't quite understand that, but okay. What the hell? What is causing that? I'm curious now. Food shouldn't be sat at the train station unless it's going somewhere. So, according to this, it's taking food to the hub. That food had to have come on this truck line. And it would have got there... Um... The construction materials line is... Right, okay. I know what's happened. Is the line feed in this, which is... I think it's this line. Yeah, this line is picking up food, bringing it there. Then it's swapping it over to this line to take to this train station. And we do not want it doing that. So, uh, I'm going to replace these. And I'm going to tell them, only carry construction materials. Replace now. Yes. And that should stop that from happening. So once the next train picks that up, it should stop doing that. Right, what other depots are there? There's one in the city. Well, there's two in the city. Three in the city. Oh, wow. Okay. That's a lot more than I was expecting. Look at that, the way that's completed that road along the riverfront. That's pretty cool. Oh, come on, game. Now, that is just going to drive me mad. That needs to be connected. So seriously, that needs to connect up. I don't know what type of road this is. Uh, probably that one. No. Yep, it is that one. Like, the way that was, just no. That would drive me mad. I'm OCD when it comes to things like that. Right, by road vehicles. Which lines are is it on more than anything? No, that's the wrong place. Here. Um, kind of... Mainly Vinewood for that one. That's even. That's pretty even. Yeah, we just need lots of vehicles on all of them. By road vehicles, max... And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Set you all on Del Perro Con Mat 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Set you all on Del Perro Food 1. Done that. 
And we've still got 7 million, that's pretty good. Now we've got construction materials on both lines. So hopefully the CONMAT line should start kicking in soon. My hope is that by the end of the episode, this hub will be so successful and so good. Oh, we've got construction materials waiting here now. My hope is it'll be so good that we can rip out the old infrastructure. That's the plan anyway, or at least start ripping out. I'm thinking rip out the boat lines first and a few truck lines and a few train lines. Make sure nothing's broken and then start ripping out basically everything except the passenger lines. That's the plan. I also need to think of a way to get stuff into grapeseed. I might just have a big ass, like a sub depot here and have trucks branching off. That could work. In fact, that's quite a good idea. One of the first lines to go is definitely this one here, which goes to Stab City and Sandy Shores, because if anything, we need to move it to start going to grapeseed. So, yep. Look at that, we got 500 waiting for LS. We need to get some more trains on there, but we haven't got enough yet. Uh, do I borrow? I suppose I have to. Yeah, I probably should, shouldn't I? Right, borrow. I'll try 10 first to see if that's enough. So borrow 10 million and buy trains. What's on there? I think it's Milwaukee. Yeah, it's Milwaukee's. And I can't remember. That was the line, wasn't it? LS food. Right. LS food. And you've got AAR boxcar Great Northern. So you uh, by train. AAR boxcar Northern. Which is... Which one is that? Boxcar... Boxcar... Great Northern. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just add enough for that. Set you all on LS Hub. That one. And we probably need to put another one on the main line bringing the food down so you buy trains uh, this I don't know what it is give me a second uh, food hub vehicles is carrying southern pacific boxcars so depot buy trains Milwaukee I haven't got enough Borrow another 10. There. So buy you. And it was, did I say Southern Pacific? I think I did. Doesn't really matter if this mix matched, but I prefer them the same. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Mm. Take it up to 22. Six, seven, eight. Set you all on Food Hub. Right. How are the construction materials doing? Combat Hub. Uh, I should probably check on here, actually. Let's sort it by balance. So, what's anything making us a lot of money yet? Not really. What's losing us the most money? <laughs> Wow. It'll take some time to build up. It will. It will. Hopefully not that long though. The food kicked in pretty quick. I'm impressed. But it doesn't look like the same is going to happen for the construction materials. TF Food Hub. Although it is making us two and a half million. To be fair, the, the food line. Hopefully a lot of these lines are going to jump up to positive soon. It's mainly the CONMAT lines losing us the most money at the moment. 
I am thinking we need to keep an eye on the trucks though, make sure we got enough trucks. So, you're okay. You're okay. You've got tons of food waiting for you. Not, I didn't want the train, I wanted the station. 700, god we need another train. Wow. Just check then your first. Uh, yeah, that seems to be relatively under control. Right, we definitely need some more trains. So I think I'm just going to have to borrow the entire loan again. And even then we probably won't have enough. Uh, this is a bummer. Buy trains. We got 10 million. We got enough for the train and one car. Wow. Buy. Oh, two cars now. Southern Pacific. Buy. Buy. Ooh, can we get a third one? Yep, yeah, three. This might take a while. Uh, I'm not. I'm not gonna wait. I can't be bothered to wait. What are you complaining about? Hello. Uh. What the hell? Why are you moaning? I don't see what's wrong with it. Waiting for free path? What the hell? Oh, I can see what the problem is. Um, flip you round. And once you clear, flip you back round and stop you. That's going to be a problem. Right, that's clear now. Wait for the next train to get clear. How the heck am I going to solve this? We could start ripping out the food lines. Like, the ones we just put in are doing pretty damn well. Um, oh my god, how are we going to solve this? Hmm. Okay, let me just clear this so we have a bit of a bit of room to operate. Auto save, and then I'm gonna have to figure out a way to solve this problem. The obvious solution is a flying junction, but I don't think that's honestly worth it. Of course, the other solution is where's the signal? Uh, it is there. Not, oh, we haven't even got $300 at the moment. Come on. I can't even take out any more money because we haven't got a loan. Right, let me get some money and think of a solution to this. Clear the, clear the problem. And then I'll bring you back and we'll probably end up building something or at least changing something. So let me do that and I'll see you in a second. Right, okay guys. So... The problem was that the food line and the construction materials line were holding each other up here. And I removed one of the signals which would stop the trains passing through this junction. But the problem is, well basically there is no other problem. So we need to get rid of the construction materials line. Which is risky but I think it's worth it. I honestly do. So we need to rip off this bridge here rip off all the track down to here and then we have the hub like this this old hub I put in uh, not long ago and from that uh, that's feeding Sandy Shores, Stab City with construction materials and also the stone line runs through there so I think we need to get rid of all this I need to redo this track here so the stone line can still run and then I'm going to rip up all of this, which goes to Stab City and Sandy Shores, uh, connect this road up and start sending vehicles into Stab City and Sandy Shores. And this is going to be a pretty big project, so I'm just debating on whether to time lapse it. That's the, th the, pr the thing, because I know some people don't like time lapses, but the problem is, 
I don't talk much when I'm building, so I'm trying to concentrate. So I'm just trying to weigh up whether it'd be better not talking much and not making much sense or doing a time lapse. And I don't know, I'm thinking a time lapse, but I'll do a short one and I'll bring you back straight after that. So let me get on with this. Enjoy this time lapse, go make a cuppa if you want to, if you don't like time lapses, and I'll bring you back momentarily. Okay guys, so that was a little short time lapse for you and basically all I did was remove this station here, remove all the lines which we didn't really need anymore and also I electrified this track along here, the um, track that takes the cows to the food farm and I was going to replace the vehicles with electric vehicles because it is kind of needed looking at how many cows are here but it's 42 million a piece for each line that is uh i don't think so <laughs> definitely not at the, the moment so that's gonna have to wait a little bit but 
I just I really cannot wait. This is this hub system should in theory work really well. One thing I do want to do, first thing at first, I want to check how many construction materials are here. Not that many. Uh, that could be a problem. What I should do is this line here, which goes to the quarry, I should rename that to TF uh, Stone. No, Sandy Stone one so it just won't get confused and then I want to check the profits on the lines uh, why have they got no vehicles on them probably because they don't exist anymore what's Polito Bay Central oh yeah they're the lines we got rid of so I can go into this and TF Conmat so it should be down here somewhere. There they are. You go and you go. And I think that's it for vehicles, for lines without vehicles. Yep, it sure looks like it. Right, TF Food Polito Hub. Still losing us money. Uh, why is that? Not entirely sure why that is. TF food, oh no, it goes to here, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, why would that be? I don't know. I think it just needs time to settle in. Are all the vehicles running? Oh, there's only one, and it should be. Yep, it is. It's only got 14 on board. Perhaps we overdid it a little bit. It'll pick up over time. Uh, the other major loser is TF Conmat Hub. What's that carrying? Oh, I think we find out why he's losing his money. Waiting for free path. No, why is that? Something's broken down here. You. You got flipped around. And any of us? I don't know why that got flipped around, probably when I was electrifying the track. So what I should really do is first of all spell Sandy right. There's an A in there. And secondly, oh, I didn't mean to close that. Make sure all the vehicles are running. You're stuck in the queue. You're that one. And you are also stuck in the queue. So they lo those lines should work now. So, what else is losing us the most money? Nothing else is losing us over a million. The Conmat lines are not doing well. Chumash is... Uh, it's carrying a full load, so that should start making us some money soon. Anyway guys, I think that will call it there. This has been quite a productive video. Next video, I'm going to put in the hub at Great Seed. I avoided doing it in the time lapse because I know not a lot of you want to see time lapses. Let me know what you think about that, by the way, guys. It is nice to know what people think. And I thought that was a train stuck there then, but it's not. And in the meantime, I'm going to go around, do some general maintenance, upgrade some of the tracks to high speed and electric. I'm going to do some smoothing. And make sure you come back for the Grape Seed hub grapeseed hub that's a hard one to say and i will see you next time peace out guys